Hi, I'm Giuseppe Bianchini, Product Manager for Dalbello Ski Boots. Today we present the new DRS, DRS 2.0. Athletes are already skiing with, with it, but we have a completely new boots, as you can see here. So we have new mold shell, new mold for the calf, new design, new buckles, everything is new. Just we kept the color combination of Dalbello color. You can read the info box here, Dalbello uh, ray system, forward lean from 14 to 16 degrees and the last 92 millimeters. So we are even tighter and more precise than the previous DRS. We have completely new buckles, new buckles in three different dimensions. We had the big one for the cuff, the medium for the first position of the shell and the small one. So when you go inside the turn skiing, you don't have the risk to touch the snow anymore with the buckles. Very important details. We have new base buckles, even lower, more integrated with the shell and with the contour of the boot. We have new shape of the sole and new lifters. We have more screws around the boot, closer to the perimeter, to the edges of the boots, in order to be even more precise and avoid the kind of wave effect that you create putting many screws. So more precision, more power transmission and easy to work for the boot fitters. We have way better back support, bigger screws here in order to push more against the plastic wall. We have more precise alignment between shell and cuff. In the front we have completely new cuff, special dedicated for every single size and we have a deeper we call v-cut here in order to have a better torsional forces and more uh, uniform distribution of the pressure of the buckles so you can see the buckles here pull really in the right direction not straight like the upper part you can see here uh, two cutted shell this could two cutted shell show you how we develop the 97 millimeter last I can, as you can see here on my right, you see the DRS 140. DRS 140 is 97 millimeter last. It's not 92, 92 workup last, but a little bit more comfortable. Very race oriented still, but with a different concept. So externally is exactly the same boot as the workup is, but internally we have a different set of plug. Means that we have different thickness between the workup version and the 97 millimeter version. These plastic walls are thinner than the workup. These allow us to have a bigger volume for wider fit. So also people want to enjoy a race boot can use our DRS 140, DRS 130, DRS 110 flex. Always very good performance race oriented, but a little bit bigger volume for bigger feet and to enjoy the entire day of skiing, not just the race period. We have new design also for the liners. We kept the construction of the liners always with adjustable tongue. We make a new collar. Collar is this piece around the upper part of the liner and it's injected. It's not a cutted piece, but a real injected plastic piece to be even more precise better lateral transmission and better back support. About the liners, one more time, we have the workup version that you can recognize thanks to the red D here. So even if the boot is hidden, you can immediately see from the upper part that is a workup liner when it fits in the boot. About the 97 millimeter last, you can recognize because you have always a white D, as you can see here and here on the 130. A different uh, concept, talking about the 140, is the tongue. The 140 brings the workup tongues, as you can see in red, like the workup version. The 130 has a softer tongue and softer inlining in order to be more comfortable. So in the DRS 140, you have a very direct power transmission thanks to the tongue 
and the internal material, very direct and stiff. On the 130, you still have the 97 mm last, but it's a little bit more generous and comfortable for the people that don't want to have too direct and aggressive boots, but something in the middle, still racing oriented. We started from the very beginning with the smallest size in the development of this new DRS, so no compromise. We maximize the performance to satisfy every single athlete we have. So from the very beginning, we started with the size 23, 24, and this size 22 and 23, the smallest, have a, a, just one cuff for the women. Then for the size 24, we have bigger women in the World Cup like Emily Wickstrom and some other skiers and we made a special cuff a little bit higher and stronger for them. Alice Robinson is skiing with the size 4, that is 23.5. She's already skiing since last January, so it's already one year she made already several victories and podiums with the new DRS and she likes from the very beginning the way how she can ski and she can push with it. Very balanced forces and a forgiven boots, but still a very good energy and very good power transmission from the very bottom. Uh, going up with the sizes, we had Soleva Gross with size 6, 25.5. So we have a combination of power and even more lateral transmission thanks to the harder polyurethane we have. We use for these boots the highest quality of TPU of polyurethanes uh, that are able to absorb all the vibration from the terrain. Uh, size 6 and 7 we have more or less 80% of our athletes in the World Cup. That's the reason why we have one cuff for these two sizes. We can develop even faster the cuff for these two sizes, thanks to the feedback of our athletes. Zurbriggen, Federico Liberatore, uh, Joshua Sturm has size 7, and uh, they like also these boots because it's smoother and more forgiven. I forgot to mention Pertel, a very young and talented Austrian guy, who already made a podium this year, and he's still uh, on the size 6, as Soleva and Gross are. The Dores uh, Bello is a fantastic boot so, for, uh, for uh, us, so, for uh, ski racing, and uh, it's awesome. So yeah, the new uh, Dalbello boots uh, look very well and works very well, and yeah, it's always nice to ski with them. The DRS is amazing, it's really stable and it gives me a lot of power at the same time. The new DRS is what you, you need. Incredible. E-boots. Item. <laughs>